Hello, I am the Cool Banana DX, and welcome back to my live stream slash let's play of Sonic Frontiers. Not necessarily welcome back to the live stream because the live stream's been going for an hour. But okay, uh, last time we got here, we got through the first couple cyberspace levels. We got ourselves our first Chaos Emerald, and uh, my headphones are too on my ears. I can't hear myself speak. I need to be able to hear myself speak or I am uncomfortable. There we go, that's better. I'd rather the headphones be uncomfortable on my head than not be able to hear myself speak. I can't speak good as it is, so I need to be able to hear what I'm saying. But right, we got ourselves a gargantuan mini boss here. And you can cheese this, this you can cheese this, a Sura pretty easily. I'm pretty sure that's how you say it, I don't know. I'm not good at pronouncing stuff. You can cheese this boss pretty easily though. Just jump up here. Okay, don't, don't do that. <laughs> right, let's try this again. You can cheese this boss pretty easily when you're anyone but cool banana. Right, just, just, just come up here. Do a little jump so you don't fall. And then you just bat, 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 bat. Just a few times. Break this. And then you get knocked back. You want to boost and then jump. I couldn't remember which order you did it in. Yeah, you can get back up there pretty easily without even going on the ground. Oh my god. What am I doing to this game? This doesn't have. This never happened to me when I played this before. I played this game for over 100 hours. There we go. Back on Asura's body. That's what you want to do. And uh, once you get higher up in the levels, too, you can. Oh. Oh. Aha! If you um, recover from that as well, you don't take damage, which is really, really thoughtful. <clears throat> I don't remember them Red Bulls. That's probably because I I killed it killed it so fast before, after a while, that I forgot about them, to be fair. Oh, another thing to uh, note about Sura. I'm pretty sure if you attack the underside of Sura's feet, uh, it gives you more gears. I'm not 100% on that, though. Alright, let's go into the cyberspace now, because we have the uh, extra... Is that... Is it, oh, Coco. Oh, I can get a skill. I should do that. Uh, Phantom Rush. Yes, give me that straight away. I know how to use Phantom Rush, but I will show it off. I love the sliding attack like that. And then ba 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 That's how Phantom Rush works. You just build up a meter after like doing um, a long enough combo. And you do a ton of damage. This isn't really going to come into play that often until, well, towards the end of this island. <coughs> uh, actually, no, that's a lie because I'm not doing much damage. That is going to come in useful, this island. That is a complete and utter lie. We're going to make use of that fairly soon. We got a speed highway looking one. Some of these I remember getting S rank like immediately. Ah, Sonic 4, is that you? Actually, no, it really wasn't Sonic 4 there. That was the polar opposite. You couldn't even get on the wall. Sonic 4, you couldn't get. Oh. <laughs> Bye, Sonic. Uh, does that count? Is that just. No. Why does it do that? Why didn't it just restart the stage and restart the timer? Like, I just think that's really douchey. Because there's no time limit. No, no, not time limit. There's no um, lives in this game. So it's not like it's... That being the reason. Give me that red ring. G give, give me the red... Turn around, Sanic. There you go. Right. In there, get the red ring. Uh, we want to go back up here, actually. There you go. That worked that time. And we want to do that. 
this reminds me of freaking Radical Highway when you're racing against Shadow in Sonic Generations for the 3DS. If that's what they've taken inspiration from, I'm going to go absolutely crazy. Yeah, I'm still still not seeing anything that tell me it's not. I mean, I know it's Speed Highway, but like they only have so many assets to use. I mean, Skyrail, if that I don't even know if that's what it's called. It, it, sh that one shadow level that takes place in Pumpkin Hill in the daytime in Sonic Adventure 2. That one. <clears throat> yeah, I definitely didn't get the S rank there. But that S rank is very doable. That is very easy. Alright, let's get that in like a millisecond. I'm not even going to try. Maybe I shouldn't get so cocky. This game will like, kick me in the balls. Get myself safe. Start boosting again. Get that. Uh huh. Down there. Ooh, that was risky, but it worked out. And we're basically at the end of the level now, so yeah, this was not hard. <laughs> Yeah, no, this, this was one that I found really easy, like, first playthrough too. I'm pretty sure my first playthrough, I got all four of them on my, like, first try. I'm obviously not going to be playing as good because there's more for me to actually be looking at here. I want to go check chat, check the timer, make sure the recording isn't just died on me or something. Also, it's unfortunate that I can't record this in 4K. I'm playing it on a Series X. Just just can't record it in 4K. So like, the internal resolution of this video, I guess you would say, if you going by like, I don't know, <laughs> freaking emulator standards, that's all I know that from. I'm not exactly what you'd call an aficionado in like anything to do with technology. I am thick. I am thick. Not with two Cs, but with two Ks. I am now dubbing thick with two Ks, meaning extremely stupid. Probably means something very different. And I've just left Amy in there. I forgot to get her in the last episode. How could I do that? You know, it's a good thing, actually. Cutscenes and all that. So let's go, uh, let's go free it. I don't want to do this. I don't want free enemies in my time. I don't know. Alright. Give me them tokens and them coins. Oh, yeah! Big fishing coins. There we go. I'm pretty sure comic book characters get referenced in this game as well, which is pretty cool. Uh, I, I, I've I never actually read any Sonic comics, which makes me feel like an absolute philistine. Uh, Sonic's my favorite video game character, and I've not looked at any media outside of a couple TV shows. And Oh, a pirate Coco. That's probably one of the ones that's worth a lot. Just different, like, themed ones. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's 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 get Amy out of the stasis pod. Amy, is that you? Hello, is someone there? Help me! Hang on. Maybe messing with the ruins will fix things. No, no, you just need to collect a bunch of them hearts, my guy. Here. I feel fine. 
But that energy that was holding me prisoner went into you. Eh, I've been infused with weird zappy stuff before. Besides, I feel like it gave me some kind of boost. Well, in that case, we need to get moving. If I was trapped, I'm sure Tails was too. Good call. I'll scout around and find you later. Deal? Deal. Be careful. Careful? Where's the fun in that? <clears throat> Those sassy eyes. Oh, it does actually give him a boost. Grand Slam. Is that what I'm... I'm pretty sure Grand Slam is the parry counter. Let's double check that. Uh, yeah, yeah. Grand Slam parry counter. There you go. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew I wasn't going loopy. I knew I wasn't bad at video games. I knew it. Let's go. All right. Uh, this guy. Now, these things are a pain in the ass to fight early on. Yeah, you, you could have not done that in the middle of a fight. I don't even know if I can actually beat this guy at this level, to be completely honest. Oh yeah, I can. You just got to side loop him. I forgot how much damage that did to the fucker. <laughs> I shouldn't be swearing so much. This is Sonic. <clears throat> it's serious Sonic, though. Nah, it doesn't make it any more justified. I'd be bleeping him out in the YouTube videos, most likely. Either that or just, just stop doing it and just be like, yeah, no, I don't. Fuck it. <laughs> the word fuck is funny, okay? It's just fun to say. Can you stop getting the balls back faster than I can delete them? Oh, you did not. You slowed me down. Oh, you're done. Speed ain't mending nothing. Oh. oh these things are pain in early... Early levels. Let me get my rings back. That I stole them all from me. Let's go. Okay. He really got those balls back already. My guy. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention the infinite boost. If you do an infinity symbol with a Psy loop, you get an infinite boost for a while. Really, really, really useful against certain mini bosses. How do I do this? Oh yeah, you just, 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 bat. There you go. Uh, there you go. Mission five complete. All right. Another mission over here. Let's grab this. Ah, speed challenge. My favorite. And it's taking us to our next mini boss as well, which is pretty nice. And we'll do that. Why not? Let's not go gr grinding on random rails. There we go. And you can see there's another mission available nearby. And there's one right here as well. Let's not forget that. 
These ones are just weird. I, I, I actually don't get these at all. It's just, just, just boosting the wheel bit. I guess your speed level has to be up to par with what it wants. I guess. But yeah, no, I've never struggled with those. Then again, I did make sure my speed was at 99 before anything else. Oh, that's a real dickish placement. He didn't make me drop rings, but rings dropped anyway. That's really bizarre. I'm not sure why that happened. Anyway, we got ourselves Coco and Elder Coco. Well, no, we just have the Elder Coco. We've got Coco on us, but... Find and bring Coco to the Elder Coco. He will be able to raise Sonic's top speed and maximum ring capacity. Go to the Hermit Coco to change how these upgrades are set. My name has been lost to time, so please simply call me Elder Coco. Couldn't see the thing for a second, so I was just having to skip through. I wish I didn't. It has been a... <clears throat> I know exactly what voice I'm doing for the Cocos. James, it has been my job to look after all the little ones. But over time, I lost track of so many. Sonic, may I ask you to return my, char return my charges to me? Oh, this is Sonic talking now. Oh, God. I can't even tell if it's Sonic or the Coco talking. Sure thing, Gramps. If I see anything while I'm helping my friends, I'll bring them back to you. That's a silver voice more than a Sonic voice. What the hell? <laughs> uh, a true hero. I will happily reward your efforts. Let me see. I can do two things for you. Increase your ring speed, increase your speed, or raise the maximum capacity of your rings. Cool, let's do it. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, boost gauge. Oh, you can actually get upgrades to the frickin' boost gauge now. Well, that's convenient. I think that'd be something they put in at the start of the frickin' game. You know, not frickin' two updates in. What should we start with? Ah, uh, speed. <clears throat> I definitely want to increase my ring capacity too, but speed. Are you serious? Do I not have that many cocoa? Oh, okay. Oh, wait, no, yeah, because he just gave me a boost to my ring speed, so it wasn't worth more cocos. Oh, it just went to Windmill Isle. <laughs> Nice. Huh. Let's grab ourselves this Chaos Emerald and then we'll go do another cyberspace level. We we'll only have a few left to do after that. And once all of those are done, we will go get all the Chaos Emeralds and bang out all the missions very quickly. And then finish the island. Oh, I forgot about this. Forgot about the frickin' marketing of the game. <laughs> I guess that's one of the Titans keeping Amy trapped. I've got a job to do. If we are fortunate, it will destroy you.
Okay. We're fighting this big old guy. This gigantic titan. And I die. Oof. <laughs> I t couldn't remember if you actually get to play in this scene or not. Yeah, just, just, just spam the homing attack and you should be fine. Woohoo! Bat this guy! Bap him! Get that Phantom Rush! Let's go! Yeah! Oh. He's all good. He's all good. He's Sonic the fucking Hedgehog. Okay. Taking that thing down the traditional way. I'm gonna need the Chaos Emeralds. Maybe a little bit of luck. Ooh! Oh my god! No, no, no! Oh my god! Oh my god! Why does it do that? All right, let's help my friend. Oh, nice. It just gives it to you straight away now. I forgot about that. Level seven attack. That's going to be really useful. But I can do a better job of balancing that energy. What do you say? Uh, yeah, this is going to basically... Um, Ah, uh, he wants me to swap the capacity, basically. And co he's the guy who can reallocate your um, other two stats. That's basically what he is. The Hermit Coco is the uh, stat um, reallocation thing. You know, <laughs> that you can do in like... Uh, games with level ups or, or, or Dark Souls or something. That seemed like a completely irrelevant map point. Just saying. Uh, oh, we got that one down there. We got a music track there. There's a fight. Oh, there's another Asura over here. Well, let's go fight. Let's fight this thing first. Whew. Don't know if I can already feel a speed a speed increase or not. I don't know. Because I don't know if having uh, the max capacity of rings you can have actually increases the top speed to 99 anyway. I can't quite tell. Because it feels so much faster, but I don't know if it's as fast as my maxed out profile. Alright. Come on, sir. Oh, God. Yeah, lock-on. I should have assumed lock-on would not have worked with Asura. And it does not. So, yeah. Well, I've actually got adequate damage as well. There you go. That's what I wanted to do before. You can, like, just get straight back on the top. Oh. Or you can just get bashed down like that. And lose all of your rings. Go. Right, there goes that one. Now, just one more on that. There you go. Pretty efficient, a Sarah kill. Not the most efficient it could have been. I really should have tried attacking the bottom of the feet. The feet. 
I say that to my bunny so much now that it's just become a normal part of my vocabulary. That is not a good thing. Ah, uh, yeah, why not? Oh, wall running counts as an action. That's great. So does grinding. Go. Whew, actually got a B rank. That makes me feel a little bit better. I'm probably going to complete all of these. I doubt I'll go for the S rank on those, though. I'm actually contemplating going for the S rank on the um, cyberspace levels. Because I, I want to get this done before the DLC comes out. We come back up here, we can speak to... I forgot your name. Sage, there you go. I really should have turned a joke. pretty uh discerning isn't it but if we come back down here we'll go oh hello we have one of these i have plenty of gears so we'll come in here and we'll do this cyberspace level and then call it an end for this episode also i i think i am gonna just 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 change this back to default. It's because it's really affecting the cutscenes in a way I did not expect it to, if I'm being honest. Let's skip that cutscene. I think I'll do something like give myself five tries at a cyber, uh, cyberspace level. To get all of the things. There we go. Chemical Plan Act 2 from Sonic Generations. Whew, something that really put me off this game at first. And you know, it still kind of does, some of it. But at the same time, they took this idea of reusing old levels and they fucking ran with it. They really freaking did. And uh, also, for some reason, whenever I play Sonic Generations on my Series X and I'm at that specific section with those hooks you grab onto, for some reason... Every time I homing attack it, it pings the wrong way and Sonic dies. I can't play Sonic Generations on my Series X. Makes me real sad. Alright, there we go. That's pretty good. I only missed one red ring. And I got an S rank. Let's go. Alright, I just got to find that red ring. I can do that. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh my goodness, I should not have been able to survive then. There's just going to be a bit of a random cut, but I just cheated death. To be fair, I probably could have jumped off and just hit them rings, if I'm being completely honest now, I'm looking at it. That would have been sick to do as well. I, I should try that. Uh, it should be around here somewhere. 
There it is. Uh, it kind of has that. It kind of has in this game the same issue Mario has in uh, Super Mario 64. It kind of has it in the other games as well, but it's really apparent there that when you jump and then you hit the other direction on the analog stick, he basically wants to do a full 360 to, like circle to turn around. Sonic does that in this game, and it's very bizarre. Oh, well, I still love the game. Still like. It's one of my favorite Sonic games. There we go. Got ourselves some more Vault Keys. And got extra ones because we 100%ed it, so... Right, let's come up here and get that map piece, and then I will end the episode. Where does it want me to go? Where or where does it want me to go? Ah, right, that's not too bad. Uh, oh, oh yeah, I gotta try and get all the way up there in just under, just over a minute. I can do that. That's not too much of a task. Look at this. Speed! Let's go. I've got so much speed. I'm the fastest Sonic that ever existed. And I've got an extra bit of my boost gauge as well, which makes me real happy. Sonic, what is happening? Alright, there we go. All done. Got ourselves another bit of map. And we got ourselves uh, some life, heart, fruit, damage, thorns. I don't know. Summon or another fruit. We'll grab the cocos. The big thing is vaguely around here. Um, oh, there's another map point over here. I might as well grab that. Uh, that's it down here, okay. Oh, it's one of the quick step ones. Oh, oh no, you do not. Aha. Can't do no quick side wheel on you yet, so I'm having to really improvise. Went a little bit ham there, but eh, it's easy anyway. Oh yeah, this gives you extra grind rails and, and stuff to go on. That's pretty nice. Alright. And... Got some of these dudes. Ah, we'll, we'll call them the pointy stick legs. Got some pointy stick legs. Ah, and we got some treasure over here. Another gear, can't complain about that. Makes going into cyberspace levels all the more easier. Alright. So then, if I come over here. Oh, our boost! I haven't been out of boost for ages. Still, I better keep on my toes. Yeah, like running out of boost is not a thing you have to deal with that often. Because obviously you can get the infinite boost. Like, it's really easy to do. I was going to fight that thing this episode. I'll have to do that next episode. Um, but right. So if we just come over here, find Amy, and uh, yeah. Right, so thank you all for watching this episode of Sonic Frontiers. Hope you enjoyed it on the stream or on YouTube. More likely on the YouTube at the moment. But, um, yeah. Next time, we'll be taking on that thing, creating that path pathway over there and going through some more cyberspace levels. 
and uh, yeah, hopefully it won't take us too much longer to actually beat this island. So, um, all right. I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye. <laughs>